Andrus Archus. Andrus Archus was a mammal that lived in the Middle Eocene period, between 48 and 41 million years ago. Kan Shuan Pao was the first to find it in Mongolia in 1923. Henry Fairfield Osborne later characterized and named it in 1924. It was named for the expedition's leader, naturalist Troy Chapman Andrews, and meaning Andrews ruler. Andrews Archus is only known from a single skull, which is one of the most fascinating things about it. This cranium, which resembles that of a wolf, stands nearly three feet tall and contains all of the necessary characteristics to classify this animal as a mammal. Andrews Archus is shown as a canine with a large snout and striped or spotted fur in photographs. While the color of this animal's fur would not have been known, scientists can make educated guesses about its size and attitude. By estimating the size of its skull in the area where it lived at the same period, Andrus Archus was estimated to be around 6 feet tall at the shoulder and 12 feet long, though this cannot be proved at this time. This would put its weight anywhere between 500 and 1,000 pounds. However, paleontologists are quick to point out that no credible estimate of its size can be produced at this time. It's merely a conjecture right now until additional fossil data is gathered. Andrus Archus, on the other hand, would be the largest carnivorous mammal to have ever walked on solid ground if it was this big. It would have been a terrifying experience for herbivores at the time. It would also have had a broad hump on its back to help anchor its massive head to the rest of its body. Another interesting tidbit about Andrus Archus one theory is that this animal had incredibly powerful jaws, which is supported on scientific evidence. There's no justification for such a huge skull if it's not necessary. However, experts are presently unsure of how potent its bit was. Since its discovery along the seashore, it has been speculated that this species may have eaten turtles and mollusks with its formidable jaws. This big, wolf-like mammal lived in the Eocene period, from 45 to 36 million years ago. It had a large torso, a long tail, and hooved toes, and walked on four short legs. Andrus Archus Andrus Archus is closely related to hippos and whales, both of which are part of the artiodactyls, a broader order of mammals. Sheep, pigs, cows, deer, giraffes, and antelopes are among the two toad-hooved mammals. Andrus Archus was a mammal that lived in the Middle Eocene period between 48 and 41 million years ago. Andrus Archus is shown as a canine with a large snout and striped or spotted fur in photographs. Andrus Archus was a scavenger and omnivore, meaning it ate everything. It belongs to the Mesnichids, a group of carnivorous hoofed mammals. Most Mesnichid bones have been discovered near rivers and beaches, implying that this is where they lived and hunted. With no medications are required to tame this beast because of its pleasant demeanor. To acquire its favor, all one has to do is provide it with enough food. When tamed, they become robust and dependable mounts that can devour just about anything. Get latest information please subscribe press the bell button.